dynamicartstore.com to get the cars. Right. Icons, legends, aiming at the stars. Personally, at checkout to save your points. And now your bank account won't be staying empty. empty. Dynamicartstore.com. Right. Use code Hursty. Go on. Hey there guys, welcome back to Hursty Games and welcome to a player review of the new Inform slash Foot Champions red pick version of Mohamed Kudos. As you can see in my Gold 3 rewards, I packed myself or picked up the uh, red version of this card. My red picks were not very good in regards to rating. I got him and Danny Almo or Almo, however it's said. Uh, but I thought this guy actually looked half decent. His card looks pretty darn good. Uh, and a bit of a super sub, so I thought, you know what, I'm going to try him out and see how he plays in game. Left footed player, high, high work rates, four star skill moves, three star weak foot, but I find three star weak foot isn't that bad this year. Uh, I've got a lot of players like Rodrigo, for example, three star weak foot, I didn't find it a problem at all. Uh, but looking at his in game stats, he's got some pretty darn decent stats here. Physicality, I have to say, for a cam beautiful stuff i think he's gonna be a phenomenal player going forwards and backwards where i'm going to be playing him pace is very very good if i was really going to be picky about it i'd maybe go with a hawk but i've gone with a dead eye to boost that shooting boost that passing and uh, his dribbling is already fantastic i mean those dribbling stats are disgusting 96 agility and 96 balance very very nice indeed 91 stamina as well which is fantastic this is the team i'm playing him in he'll be playing as a right oh no sorry i stand corrected a left-sided cam or a left mid in game because i'll be playing either four triple two or four four two in game promise and uh malin will be playing up top and then buddha on the other wing Slightly uh, selfish reason for doing this. I'll be starting foot champs in a little bit, and I wanted a couple of warm-up games in Div Rival. And secondly, I want to see if Gomez is any good on 7 chem. So yes, I've been a bit selfish in doing this. However, it is also interesting to see if this guy's a good card because he might go on my bench. And who knows, you guys might have got him and might be wondering whether you should use him or not. So let's find out if he's any good. Okay, time for our first game. Also first game of the day. So if I'm a tad rusty, that will suck. But this is the team we're up against. A very, very nice BPL slash Liga Santander hybrid. A very, very overpowered looking team. Gonna have to try our best. Going to get the ball to Kudos nice and early here. Lovely bit of dribbling to take it past uh, St. Maximin twice there. Lovely little turn inside. Skill moves feel decent. They feel pretty good. He's won the ball there off of Furlan Mendy. We're going to turn inside again. So he's done really, really well already with dribbling. And he's won the ball back. So good physicality as well. Shame that we couldn't get much from there. But it's a good early sign for him. Good early sign. Get the ball up to Malin. Get it now out to Kudos. Or Kudos, however you say his name. Lovely bit of play there to get past I think it's Carl Walker he's got. He's a fantastic right back. So it's going to be a tricky first test. Let's see promise. We're going to let Kudos make that run. He's going to do just that. Does just about have the beating of Carl Walker here. We're going to play inside however to Malin. Back out to him. Going to dummy that first time. Take the second shot. Love that. I wasn't actually expecting him to get that. I think he made the defender there. I think it's Diego Carlos. I'm pretty sure he's played it through his legs. He did, I'm fairly sure. Lovely stuff. I wasn't expecting the goal that early. That wasn't really my main focus. My focus was can he be a good sort of... Uh, player out wide to sort of make goals but he started off by scoring one love to see it he's got the ball quite deep here can do the double r1 love that that acceleration is just going to help him with that skill move over and over again lovely little bit of one two here with malin malin now makes his way into the box malin's going to cut inside and finesse it good block but kudos here lovely first touch ah oh, not quite a good first half performance from kudos sadly i'm two one down two very very sloppy goals to concede i'm fairly sure he's literally had two shots this half but it is what it is that's classic fifa for you but i have to say kudos has played really really well he was very effective on the ball great dribbling uh and actually decent little shot on him as well well, he has just about caught, but Kudos has kept that. There's the physicality coming into effect there, because Kudos is a strong, strong customer for the kind of player that he is. And Malin's going to shoot. Malin's going to score. That's an assist. I'm fairly sure for Kudos there. Lovely, lovely stuff. We've managed to get us. Oh, it wasn't, it wasn't um, Malin. It was Buda. Either way, we get ourselves back into it, and that is all down to Kudos again. So now we've got Kudos again. Lovely double R1. Kudos. Oh, that's so unlucky. He wins it back, though. Can he get the ball in the back of the net? He can, but he's offside. That's such a shame. We have Malin on the ball here. Kudos trying to make a run outside of him. Kudos does make a beautiful run outside of him. Kudos with a strike. Oh, it's a good effort, but it hits the bar. Oh, that was such a good chance. And he has hit the bar. It was a really good effort. It beat the keeper, but it didn't beat the goalpost there. Well, we end up losing that game. I do feel a tad hard done by because I feel like I deserve more from it. But it is what it is. Those kind of games happen. We end up losing 3-2. But I have to see Kudos had a fantastic, fantastic game. It's a shame he couldn't have got that second goal. I think that obviously would have just really put the icing on the cake. You can see by far the highest rated player on our team. But it is what it is. It's one of those games. But I have to say Kudos himself didn't have a bad game at all. We're going to put the first game behind us. Go into the second game with a fresh head and hopefully get something from this. Another very good <laughs> BPL little bit there. Also a Bundesliga bit. And again, another very good Liga Santander part of the team as well. God's sake, these teams. Kudos, a lovely little turn inside there. Managed to take the defender on. Sadly, we do have to turn back. 
issue I'm having with this review is I do not like many of the forwards we've got. Malin, I'm not the biggest fan of, as it turns out. Used him in a couple of drafts and thought it was okay. Haven't enjoyed him in this at all. Buddha, not a big fan of. Quincy's overpowered as hell, but that's about it. Kudos is going to cut inside here. Plays a lovely ball to Quincy. Quincy finds the back of the net. We do get a goal back. This guy's been all over us. I cannot defend against this guy at all. But lovely assist there from Kudos. Again, lovely bit of build up. I really, really honestly think he's a very, very complete winger slash wide cam. I really do. All out wide here to Kudos. Kudos again cuts inside Mukiele perfectly. A, a player like Mukiele normally, the main thing he's got going for him is the fact that he's fairly quick for a for a big fullback. He's quite physical, so he can normally out strengthen a, a like a wide player. But I have to say, Kudos being quick but also having that physicality really negates everything that Mukiele has against uh, wingers and stuff normally. So Kudos there with another assist and again playing really really well. But again, physicality. Mukiele is not that much more physical than Kudos, therefore doesn't really massively outstrengthen him. Can he get a hat-trick of assist? That would have been a perfect way to get back into it just before half-time. But again, Kudos doing absolute bits here. Well, we nearly went in at half-time at 3-3 instead of going at 4-2 down. Vardy has been ridiculous. But regardless, Kudos has a really good first half, two great assists. Uh, and I have to say, honestly, I'm, I'm really loving his card. Already a big, big fan. Well, wide to Kudos. Kudos going to just play that ball straight around Mukiele again. A player like Mukiele is not going to be stopping Kudos anytime soon. We're just going to hit that with Kudos. Gets himself another goal. He has been, honestly, the star man this game. Two assists and a goal. Lovely stuff. Kimmich is going to go up to Kudos again. Kudos on this wide place here. Mukiele turned twice. Mukiele just honestly cannot contain this Kudos card. Kudos is again going to have to cut inside. He's going to have to pay it backwards again. Malin. It's another very good block. Man, Kudos is getting so unlucky. If I just had just an extra player in that box there, just someone sitting in that six-yard box, we would have scored. But no one was there. No one made that run. And it's such a shame because he's made some beautiful plays already this half. Malin down to Quincy. Quincy's going to go back to Malin. I need that run from someone. Malin's going to have to go himself. Malin, love that. Back in it. 4-4. Didn't have much to do with Kudos there, I'll be brutally honest. But the main thing is we're back in the game. The game ends there at 4-4. I have to say massive credit to my team from going 3-0 down. Uh, I have to say huge credit to the squad for getting back into that. And I have to say Kudos was a humongous part of that. Getting involved in literally everything apart from the final goal. But he was influential throughout. I have to say I really enjoyed this card. I think it's such a shame about his sort of links that he's going to get. But uh, anyway, let's get into the final review and my final thoughts on this card. I have to say this is a card I have thoroughly enjoyed using. As a wide cam, my cams don't tend to get too involved in directly scoring. This guy not only scored two goals, could have scored a couple more, and with a couple of different situational differences, definitely could have got a few more assists. I think with a better, like, more attacking players with him, so someone like Quincy Proms was perfect. You saw on two occasions, Quincy got in perfect spaces for him to get the assist. But I think in a couple of other situations, we could have had a slightly better player up there, and this guy would have had about four or five assists on his card after. After those two games. I thoroughly enjoyed using him. I have to say for 10,000 coins as a discard inform, this guy is definitely phenomenal. He's about 10k, roughly 11k on Xbox. But I have to say this guy's definitely worth your time. If you got him as a red pick, don't stress too much. I really, really enjoyed him. It's a real shame that he's tricky to get into a starting team, but I do think he'll be a good viable super sub. I do think there are maybe slightly cheaper super subs that will do something similar for you. People like Joseph Martinez, people like Alex Texiera, but do not overlook this guy because his physicality dribbling and pace combined makes him a real real threat his left foot as well not many of those super subs are left footed but this guy is honestly phenomenal I think if you use him at central cam or either of the wings you really are going to have yourself a little uh, super sub on your hands so hopefully you've enjoyed this review if you have then please do leave a like on the video do not overlook this card promise me you will not overlook him because I think he's very very good make sure you hit that sub button if you're new to the channel and of course turn on notifications if you want to find out whenever we upload a video or indeed go live with a live stream but for now guys I want to say thank you very very much for watching I've been Tom. You guys have been awesome, and I'll see you soon. Look after yourselves, and of course, wash your hands. What? Nah, nah, his name is Hursty. Slap bald head, yeah, it'll probably hurt me. Bang top bins, yeah, it'll probably hurt you. Ginger, streamer, platform, YouTube. Drop a name in the chat, or say hello. Entertain, yeah, you already know. Capital H, yeah, I'm a read it slow. Hursty games, yeah, you already know.